How old is too old for a stem cell transplant? Well, that's a great question. And as I get older, my perspective on this tends to change. We've learned that it's not about a defined age that determines if someone is eligible or ineligible for an autologous stem cell transplant. It has a lot more to do with what we call their frailty or their fitness level. And so we don't try to choose an exact age and say, oh, at this age we do transplant and at this age we don't do transplant. It's important for us as uh, transplanters that we carefully assess our patients and determine if this is going to be risky for them or less risky for them based on their, what we call comorbidities or other illnesses they may have, their cardiovascular and pulmonary or their heart and lung function to make that determination. So it's really not about a specific age. If you have more questions for me, tuck them into the comment section below. But remember, there are other ways to ask questions as well. You can attend a virtual webinar or attend an in-person seminar where you can ask us directly. Make sure you go to myeloma.org to learn about all these resources and more so that we can help you through your journey with multiple myeloma.